Every time you turn on a light, the power may be coming from the garbage you throw out. Xcel Energy and La Crosse County officials have been working together for decades using garbage to make electricity. They say they are getting calls from other communities trying to find a better way to throw things away. News 8's Jordan Fremstead reports. Our plant has been around over 50 years. On French Island, a facility quietly goes about its business, making power a necessity for everyone in the 21st century. We're one of the only ones in the state of Wisconsin. This power plant carries its own unique purpose. You know, we've had a partnership with the county for quite a while now. A partnership with a landfill? We average about 73,000 tons annually to the facility. Since the 1980s, the La Crosse County Solid Waste Department trucks some of the waste they receive in a five-county area to Excel's energy plant every year. Yeah, that's a lot of garbage coming in. Yeah, it really is. The garbage arrives and they separate the burnable items. Normally then we mix it with wood waste and then we burn it to make steam, which turns a turbine and we make electricity. It's a process that has saved the need to build nearly five medium-sized landfills. And now they're getting requests from other companies and communities like Chicago who are looking to get rid of their garbage in a better way. More and more of them that have zero waste goals. Right now we have about eight companies that we have allowed in. Um, it equates out to about four to six thousand tons of garbage annually. The plant is not big enough to take on too much more of this waste, but they'll take what they can. It's been embraced, it, it works well with our system, and they fit in great with the community. It's 75,000 fewer tons of this while accomplishing this in the process. In La Crosse, this is Jordan Fremstead, News 8. Officials at both XL and La Crosse County say they recently extended their contract to cont continue this process from 2023 to 2030.